In this video we're going to take a look at the ox metal milling a batarang out of some aluminium. So this video is going to contain a lot of jump cuts and time lapses of the milling process with the ox CNC router mill here and we're going to have a closer look from start to finish of how objects are created with a CNC mill and we're going to take a look by milling out the batarang so full disclosure I did not design this 3D part I found it on Thingiverse and a big thanks from me to the creator of this I absolutely love your design and there'll be a link in the video's description if you want to go check it out so let's have a look at how the batarang is milled Tracky. So after the CNC mill has finished milling out the batarang, the batarang is held in place so that it doesn't break away from the aluminium sheet with four small support tabs which are cut away with a small hacksaw blade and then the aluminium is filed flush so that it goes unnoticed. And at this point you could hit it with some wet and dry sandpaper and uh, you know, make it look like glass finish. However, I actually find the lines quite appealing. It might perceive to be quite rough on camera, but in reality, these lines are actually pretty fine. And also, if you are actually interested in making this very CNC uh, router mill, there'll be a link up in the video's corner, so you can go check that video out, see if you're interested in building it for yourself. Other than that, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. Bye for now.